Hi friends, metabolic syndrome is seen more frequently in patients of schizophrenia than general population. It is possible that genetic factors play a role, but it is also likely that lifestyle issues, especially poor nutrition and reduced exercise habits also play a key role. Moreover, in recent times, more frequent use of some second-generation antipsychotic agents, especially olanzapine, has added fuel to the fire by inducing more weight gain and dyslipidemia in these patients. Weight gain and metabolic syndrome are two commonest reasons for switching, and eripiprazole has been suggested as one of the ideal drugs for switching, as it has got low risk of inducing weight gain and metabolic derangements. Earlier studies have been done in this field which have shown that switching was associated with beneficial effects on various parameters of metabolic syndrome, but it was at the cost of clinical stability. The reasons for clinical destabilization in these earlier studies could be because of abruptly stopping the earlier antipsychotic agent, switching quite ill treatment resistant schizophrenia patients, or sometimes acute psychotic patients and even in some studies, lack of close clinical monitoring could be a reason. We now present a 24-week prospective, double-blind, randomized, open-label study of switching, wherein we switched olanzapine-treated stable patients of schizophrenia with metabolic syndrome to eripiprazole. We in this study found that switching to eripiprazole was associated with beneficial effects on various parameters of metabolic syndrome without any clinical destabilization as was measured by positive and negative syndrome scale and clinical global impression scale. While those who continued on the previous antipsychotic agent that is olanzapine experienced further deterioration in parameters of metabolic syndrome. The likely reason why in our study there was no clinical destabilization even after switching could be careful cross titration of antipsychotic agents switching only those patients of schizophrenia who were already stable on previous antipsychotic agent and close clinical monitoring of our patients. We at the end recommend that switching is a viable strategy if close clinical monitoring and careful cross titration of antipsychotic agents is possible. Thank you.